How you going? My name's Nathan from NZ Personal Training. This video is a video diary of, over the course of the next 10 weeks to promote our new 10 week challenge which is coming up later in the year. The 10 week challenge coming up is going to a fantastic cause and for all details please go to nzpersonaltraining.com.au There are two different categories within the NZ Personal Training 10 week challenge. One is weight loss and one is muscle gain. Myself, I'm participating in a weight loss category. My goal is to lose 10 kilos over the course of the next 10 weeks, and my starting weight as of today is 98.4. Here's the photo. In order to achieve this goal over the course of the next 10 weeks, I'm gonna be very strict on my diet, and I'm gonna increase my cardio and my weights training. As far as training goes, I'm going to train five days a week and have the weekends as a bit of a recovery for my body in order to get ready for the following week. Diet wise, I'm going to increase my protein levels and I'm going to decrease my carbs. I find that works best with my body, but results may vary depending on the person. I hope you enjoyed this fortnightly video diary and the rest of this DVD and it can inspire you to achieve your personal and fitness goals. For all inquiries, please go to nzpersonaltraining.com.au and enjoy the rest of the tape. Thank you. How you going? I'm currently two weeks into the NZ Personal Training 10 week challenge. I'm feeling healthy, I'm feeling great. I weighed myself this morning, I was 96.1 kilograms, which is a loss of just over two kilos over the course of the last two weeks. As far as training goes, I've been doing weights training five days a week. I've been walking five to six days a week. And I've also been trying to do three additional cardio sessions in the gym, whether it be on the treadmill or the cross trainer, to burn anywhere from 250 to 400 calories in a 30 to 45 minute session. I'm feeling good, I'm feeling healthy, I'm keen to go for the rest of the challenge. Bring it on. I'm currently four weeks into my challenge and it's going really well. I've lost a total of just over four kilos up to date and I'm expecting my weight loss will uh, slow down just a little bit over the next six weeks as I plan to hit a couple of small plateaus. And the way I'm gonna get through this is just increase my exercise and obviously be very strict on my diet. The hardest thing for me so far is probably the no alcohol, not that I'm a big drinker, but I do enjoy uh, the odd, uh, odd drink on the weekend. Now with the 10 week challenge, you can nominate two to three events in the course of the 10 weeks where you can actually drink. I've nominated a, uh, an event in a couple of weeks which I'm lo really looking forward to, but it makes it all worthwhile when you've got a bit of a goal and something to sort of aspire to. I've also increased my training. I'm doing quite a bit of uh, suspension therapy or sling, uh, sling training. With the, uh, this is the UI, the ultimate instrument. It's really good for your core stability as well as uh, getting an overall body workout. So I'm really looking forward to how uh, the next few weeks will go and uh, the end result will be. Six weeks down and I'm feeling better than ever. I've been really strict with my diet this last week and the last four weeks I'm going to really step it up a notch. My goal target was 10 kilos in 10 weeks. I'm currently at 6.1 kilos in six weeks. So I'm thinking that yeah, if I step it up, I, um, I may not hit that certain plateau because I'm going to really hone my diet in and increase my uh, cardio training as well. So I'm having a great time, I'm feeling better, I'm, uh, I think I'm starting to look a lot better. I've trimmed down quite a bit, so six kilos yeah, it is quite a bit to trim down. But um, yeah, when I hit that 10 kilo mark, I think I'll see a drastic improvement to what I was when I started. And um, yeah, my whole outlook on life is getting better and I'm feeling good and I'm loving it. So I'm looking forward to seeing what the next four weeks will bring. How are you going? Eight weeks down, two weeks to go. Now I'm still on target for my 10 kilos in 10 weeks. I'm not going to tell you what I weighed in today because I want the last final weigh-in to be a bit of a surprise for you all. Um, but let's just say I'm pretty close. I can taste it. I can feel it. Um, I've just got to get my foot over the line. So this last two weeks is going to be pounding, grinding, giving it everything I have to get to where I want to be. And hopefully the end result, I mean already I'm ecstatic at how far I've come, but hopefully the end result can result in something that I'm extremely proud of and something that can motivate you guys out there to putting everything you can into this 10 week challenge, raising some great money for charity and just really feeling better about yourself and having a better outlook on life. So I'll look forward to seeing you in two weeks time with some fantastic results. All right, 
10 weeks down, 10.1 kilo loss. I'm so ecstatic with that. It was a tough challenge. I set myself a goal of 10 kilos in 10 weeks. It was achievable. I, towards the end there, I didn't know if I was actually quite going to make it, but I uh, did everything I could to do it. I really honed in my uh, diet and my cardio towards the end. But this year we're raising some money for a fantastic cause, the NZ Personal Training 10 Week Challenge. Check it all out on our, web on our website, nzpersonaltraining.com.au and here is my before and after shots and if I can do 10 kilos in 10 weeks, the sky's the limit for you out there and we can help you with NZ Personal Training. So go to the website, check it out and have an awesome day and we'll see you soon.